Investigators are looking into a SWAT standoff in Montgomery County. Nearly a dozen bullet holes hit the windshield of the suspect's vehicle during the shootout early this morning. Our Marcus Espinoza has the details. That cell phone footage shot by a neighbor shows the perspective of what it's like to be so close to a shootout and just how dangerous that scene was early Wednesday morning. The gun and crawl out. We don't want to hurt you. Holy. He just shot at him. A shootout between a man and members of SWAT and police as seen in this cell phone footage at the Meadows apartment complex in the Montclair section of Upper Providence Township just after 3 a.m. Wednesday. We just heard bangs, just bang, 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 bang. Wes Reeser and his girlfriend Samara Messer woken up by the gunfire right outside their building early this morning. He says he heard the man only identified as being in his 60s screaming at a female passenger in his truck. Then. Things escalated when police arrived. Yeah, and the next thing we knew, they, they pulled up, um, and then a couple minutes later, he was shooting at them. He was shooting at who? He was shooting at the police. From where? From underneath the car out there, or between the cars out there. Yeah, roll on to your back. Video here provided by neighbors show police arresting the suspect at the end of the standoff. Montgomery County District Attorney Kevin Steele says police received a call about a family member suffering a mental health emergency. The caller said the man gathered firearms and put them in his truck. Police say officers then encountered the man in the complex parking lot where he crashed his truck. They say he got out and fired at officers who fired back. The man was taken to Paoli Hospital with one shot in the arm and he's expected to survive. No one else was hurt. Reeser, while scared for his family's safety, also wanted to help offering up his own apartment to SWAT members. And then they were trying to look for places to go to get a better angle mm -hmm. of wherever he was. Then I eventually came downstairs and I told them, I'm like, come on upstairs because we, we had a perfect line of where he was from our window. So they eventually came up to our bedroom and set up shop up there with the, with the rifle heading out the window. And yeah, it was nuts. The Montgomery County District Attorney is now handling this investigation. No motive was announced on why this took place, and the suspect has not yet been identified. In Upper Providence, Marcus Espinosa, Fox 29 News.